Hi everyone, Veronica here from Kitara team. Today I'm going to show you how to add the very first default domain and an SSL certificate to Kitara Tracker. This solution works only with the tracker installed on a VPS with our single click installation script. Let's begin with, with the domain. I have a domain that's carry backspace purchased from Namecheap. So, all you need here is to add an A record uh, for our service IP. If you change the IP or set it up for the first time, it may take up to 12 hours for your DNS records to update. Now, let's make sure our A record for the domain is active. I will use a terminal. You may use any DNS checker, there are plenty of them on the web. So, I open my terminal and run a command. Dig and my domain name. Dot space. Enter. Now we see that our domain has an updated A record. This is my server's IP. Now let's check KTR admin panel. After the installation, I reached my tracker via the IP address plus admin. Uh, now let's check if I can access it via my domain name. So it's uh, let's carry back dot space dash. And mean. Here we go. So we have just successfully added a domain to Kitaro. Now let's proceed with an SSL certificate. Go to your terminal and login to your VPS via SSH. So I run a command SSH. Root it. Enter. We've just logged in the SSH and now all we need is to run a command for adding an SSL. Go to Kitaro Knowledge Database, it's at help.kitarotds.com. Choose single click installation. Uh, we need uh, our section how to add an SSL after installation. Copy the command. So, Enter the comment and here I type uh, my domain name. It's very back dot space. Now follow uh, the script's instructions. Uh, we need to agree with the terms of the service. I type yes. Now we are asked to enter our email and the script is uh, installing our SSL certificate. Everything is done. Now let's check if it works. Copy the link. Nice. Let's try to log in. Sign in. Great. Now let's sum everything up. Uh, to add a domain, you just need to add an A record for your domain with your server's IP. The only thing you need. Your domain is added. To add an SSL certificate. Make sure your domain has an active A record with your server's IP. Then go to Terminal and run a command from our knowledge database to add an SSL certificate. And follow the instructions. Easy breezy! In case you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching.